Thomas to see your break. Is that going to come to fruition? I hope so. I mean, it's pretty fine. two women pound for pound. That's a, that's a pay per view fight class. Yeah, I'm willing to go down to 154, and hopefully she's willing to come up to 154 because I'm losing weight. She gaining weight. We meet right in the middle. We can fight, but um, you look it's really impressive in that victory. I mean, you look really good against the hammer. You know, you, you you're calling yourself already the all-time great women's fighter. You know, that's that's a great honor. You know, amongst the women, you got all the titles. You're the best ever amateur American female or male to win two Olympic gold medals. And also to be a two-time Olympic gold medalist and become undisputed. Undisputed. I'm the only person to do that. I mean, that's a great honor right there. Um, I say, um, when I speak of greatest woman of all time, what other woman have you seen display better skills than myself? I mean, the last fight with, with Hammer, all right, I showed her a little bit more than what I usually show, but people who know me from the amateurs, I got angles, I can box, I can bang, I have beautiful combinations, I have head movement. I don't know what other woman I've ever seen move the way that I move. I was actually surprised you out-jabbed her. Oh, did yeah. she has a very good jab. She's known for her jab, but you actually out-jabbed her in that fight. I'm a great fighter, man. What can I say? <laughs> now, Cecilia Breakers, did she say that she wants to come up and, and face you at 154? Have you heard any word on that? She said she would love for that fight between me and her to happen, but she wasn't specific about what weight and wasn't specific about when. But uh, either or, I don't wait on nobody. I'm going to stay in the gym. I'm going to stay ready. Uh, if I go down to 154, I'm going to fight those girls there. And hopefully, you know, she comes up and me and her fight. But um, I got almost eight years left in the sport. So you don't really have that long. So you need to make a mind up quick. She needs to come and make that fight happen right now. It's a, a million dollars. It's a super fight. It could be a million dollars a piece for us. Probably two. I mean, it's a huge fight. I don't I don't know why she wouldn't want to do it. And she said that she's a step above Hammer as far as her skill. So I don't believe it. I want to see it. You know, they have her as number one pound for pound, but I think after this victory, you deserve pound for pound number one in the sport of female boxing. I believe skill-wise that I box ready to show you boxing, so that's why I see pound pound. But if she doesn't want to give me that and they don't, I would love to fight for the spot. What's the best way to get the spot that I fight for? Now, if you don't get her, who's out there that you can fight possibly next? Man, whoever wants to smoke, Hannah Gabriel's want to go again. They got 154 pound champions. Those girls want to fight. Um, some girls at 60 who talk a little bit, they want to fight, you know. It don't matter. It don't, to me, it don't matter who I fight. It doesn't matter that the number is right. The money. That's what I care about. The money. Now, are you signed to the zone or you on Showtime? What, what's the situation? I'm signed to Dimitri Salida. Salida Promotions right now. I'm not signed to Showtime or any network right now. I just, me and Showtime have a very good relationship. I have a great relationship with his own also, so yeah. This is up. Thank you for this interview. No problem.